done. Uh, yeah, uh, come on. Uh. He's through the Nakama midfield, last chance before full time. He's through the Nakama midfield, last chance before full time. Shakes, aren't you bored of that game yet? Yeah, you clock it like every time you play. I don't know why you play that thing at all, brother. Why would you want to play fake football when you're going to jam the real thing against Nakama tomorrow? <laughs> Super League 3000X is just like real soccer, Cool Joe. Sorry, Shakes. Games just don't impress me. The ball gets away from him. Missed opportunity. The ball gets away from him. Missed opportunity. Ah. You lose. <laughs> hmm. It is kind of dated. But apparently the new version is going to be so good. Amazing graphics and super realistic sound effects. <gasps> oh, yeah. And the world's best players. Coming soon. Super League 4000X. Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, Big XP feeling totally nerfed right now. <laughs> I'm Alex. I'm gonna motion capture your moves for SL4000X. Hi, Alex. I'm Shakes. Uber, cool. You want Um, it's Shakes, not Uber. Uh, Uber's from Iron Tank. Uh, it's an expression. Ah, uh, saws. Uh, uh, I mean, sorry. Sometimes I forget how people speak out there. You ready for the grand tour? Huh? <laughs> Yo, 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 it's Uncool Joe. Phew, is that a funny smell or is it just a ping pong? Table tennis to you, sucker. Uh, so I'm guessing you know each other? Hey guys, meet Chill John, world's number one ping pong player. Table tennis? Everything he knows about, well, everything really, he borrowed from yours truly. Police! I'm past those beginner techniques, sucker. I am the new king of spin. Your style is still cool, Joe. Your spin is thin. Huh. <coughs> Tour is starting. You guys coming? First up, it's the coders. Super intelligent brainiacs who build the games. The testers basically play games and eat chocolate the whole day. <laughs> cool. Where do I sign up? Here we have the sound studio. Real Super League players and coaches are contributing their voices to SL4000X. Yeah, good call. The sound effects in 3000 kind of sucked. Game over. You lose. <laughs> Game over. You lose. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay. We're, we're getting there. Can you make it feel more summery, more sunny? What? This isn't the weather report. Don't worry. We're almost there. Take 346. Go. Uh, I give up. And finally, where the real magic happens. Super Strikers? The Motion Capture Studio is where we capture every detail of your moves. Every detail, hey? <laughs> yes, yes, genius, fantastic. Do it again, but into the microphone this time, yeah? <sighs> Welcome to the Motion Capture Studio. The position and movement of the sensors on your suits are recorded by special cameras, and the data is input into this computer. All right, Ooh, I read. <laughs> oh, please, Alex, don't be motion capturing this, okay? <laughs> don't worry. The only thing I want to capture is all the classic Super Strikers moves. Cool Joe, you're up. 
many times I gotta tell you guys, video games just ain't my thing. But the game won't be the same without the four pillars of spin. I don't know, brother. <sighs> Come on. All right, all right, I'll do it. <laughs> hey, what do you think you're doing? I, uh, um... It's not Cosplay Friday, is it? No. Oh, I feel like such a fool. Don't. You're rocking that look. Great costume. Uh, thanks. Hey, why don't we swap? Really? Really. Like, really, really? Really, really. Like, really! Get ready for the four pillars of spin. Left spin. Right spin. Back spin. How does he spin the ball like that? Unbelievable. Can't wait to see this stuff in gameplay. Top spin. I got this one, I got this one. Okay, you can have this one. Cool Joe! Your crosses are amazing! <laughs> Thanks, sister. And how do you guys know where the ball's gonna go? Practice makes perfect. Uh, more like practice and practice and practice makes perfect. SL4000X is gonna rock! You guys have been so much help! Yes. You've been so much help, Super Stikers. And there you have it. Cool Joe's four pillars of spin. Know them, spot them, intercept them. It will always be one of four. This is going to make Super Striker's head spin. <laughs> huh? Now I get the laugh right. It's Nakama versus Super Strikers, live from Gashuko Stadium. These two famous rivals are equally matched. But if one player can make the difference, it's Cool Joe. The Crossing King. There's the cross. Shakes and El Matador are there. Can one of them get a touch? What? Ooh, well read by Miko Chen. <laughs> Looks like Cool Joe just needs to kick to me next time. Yes? Strikers tied to the group. But it's no use. Oh! Nakama take the first game. Seems the Crossing King has been dethroned. You lose, Super Strikers. <laughs> game over. You lose. <laughs> uh. Cool Joe? What? I think I know why Nakama can read your four spins. Oh, really? How? Urigiri was at the mocap studio yesterday. <laughs> Rewind there, brother. Urigiri was where? I'm sorry. I think he saw your moves. What did I tell you? All that digital juju, no emotion capture wireless pfft, is no good, brother. Cool Joe, hey, you need to think about what happens to my ego when I'm not scoring goals, man. And don't be so selfish, okay? Thanks for coming by. We're totally gonna get our revenge in the return match. How, Shakes? Urigiri saw all my moves. 
The four pillars of spin ain't secret anymore. Hey, look on the bright side, Cool Joe. It can't get any worse. <clears throat> yo, 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 yo. Don't worry. I already signed this one for ya. Paddle power? I saw Nakama shut you down, Cool Joe. Told you I'm the new king of spin. But don't worry. Maybe you can learn a thing or two from my game. I got spin you can't even imagine. Ah! You like game shakes? Why not play ping pong till the new Super League game comes out? Table tennis, fool! Spin you can't even imagine, huh? Level one, your spin is thin. Level ten, sucker. Level 24, are you the next speed master? <laughs> Level 36, you got to move, Slick! Level 50, oh yeah, new speed unlock, the Cork Scrolls! Yeah! Oh, I knew I could do it. Oh. I gotta find Jill Dawn. Oh, come on, Shakes. At least wash your hands. Thanks for the help, Alex. It's the least I can do after my noob mistake with a mocap. This is the place. But I don't know how we're gonna get in, especially considering you're friends with Cool Joe. Undercover, of course. Don't want to give the game away. Uh, didn't we already do that? the corkscrew. Seriously, Cool Joe, there is a fifth spin, and I know how you can learn it. Please, Shakes, I've already learned my lesson. Why would I take your advice ever again? Listen to him, Cool Joe. Yeah, come on, we need you out there. Or I might not score any goals. Whatever. All Shakes has done the last few days is play paddle power. Yeah. That's kind of how I found out about the fifth spin. Video games, table tennis, chill John. These are a few of my least favorite things. The fifth spin exists. I developed it. Hm. I'll believe it when I see it. Oh. Huh. To help you learn the corkscrew extra fast, we're gonna mocap it and analyze it. Just like you would have giddy did with your moves. I guess if video games got us into this mess, video games can get us out. Uh, there's one other thing. Just like in Paddle Power, the corkscrew has to be unlocked. Really? I want to prove once and for all who's the best spinner of them all. Like I said, I don't play the pawn. Table tennis! Uh, need goals, Cool Joe. Do it for me. And the team also. All you have to do is get one point off him. Let's stay at Strikerland! Last week we saw these two teams aren't as evenly matched as they once were, Brenda. 
so, Coach has made a big change. Klaus is on the left wing, and Cool Joe is nowhere to be seen. Joe's crosses make scoring easy. No, they don't. Okay, maybe they do a little. Don't worry, guys. I'm sure Cool Joe got that point by now. Uh. <sighs> yo, yo, guy plays like a total badger. Come on, you scoundrel. Let him beat you. Just one point. No way, El Matador. I want to win fair and square. Oh, this is not the time for honor, Cool Joe. Forget your pride. Abandon your principles, man. No way. I have to embrace my principles. I'm no gamer like Shakes. I can't play table tennis like Chill John. I'm a footballer. Run, Run, Cool Joe. You can do it, Mom. You can do it. John, the number one spinner mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. is always the winner. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you what are a legend. Oh, yes. <laughs> what a rally. Foot table tennis? Come on! Deal's a deal, brother. The second half is underway. Fantastic news for Super Strikers. Looks like Cool Joe's on the field and immediately into the action. Woohoo! Go Cool Joe! Even if Cool Joe can pull off the corkscrew, how do we know where it's gonna go? No practice and practice and practice, right? Yeah. And from what I've seen, the corkscrew has a mind of its own. What's the use, Cool Joe? We know all your spins. This is it. Fifth spin coming up. I hope. One of four. It's sailing into the danger area. But it's gone past everyone. Yeah, 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 yeah. What was that? Oh, yeah! The number one spinner is always the winner. <sighs> I lose! Nice! Like dusk. We're keeping that one. <sighs> oh, man. SL4000X is beyond awesome. Got you again, Urigiri. <sighs> I lose! <laughs> 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 hey, guys. Yo, 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 yo. Aw, oh, Shakes, you still playing that old school SL4000X game? 
We're jamming our new hybrid Paddle Power versus Super League game. Spinner takes all. I just got it delivered from Alex. <laughs> Looks cool. Can I try? No way, man. I've only got to like level 41. In time, brother. In time. <laughs> Oh, man. Clean your locker day is the worst. Shakes! <laughs> hmm. I suppose my locker is a little untidy. No ways! My adventure annuals. I loved these when I was a kid. Oh, this one's my favorite. About a hundred years ago, a Brazilian businessman named Albert Douglas Ventura took on the most insane football project ever. Building a stadium in the middle of the Amazon jungle. Ooh. But the extreme location made construction a nightmare. His crew bailed on him, but Ventura stuck it out, refusing to abandon his dream. You do know that's totally made up, right? Ah, no. Of course. <laughs> The Lost Stadium is totally real, Shakes. Oh, yeah? And where's Ventura now? He never returned from the jungle. Anacondas, piranhas, panthers! The Amazon is a dangerous place. Brazil has something even more dangerous than all of that. And he's coming to strike a land. Match day at Strikerland. And Super Strikers are struggling to deal with commentary Starman. The Master of Flair. The Samba King. John Aldo. Welcome to the end of the road. Ha, you think you can stop my Samba style? That's cute. When you're as skilled as me, you do as you please. Ha-ha! <laughs> the Brazilian maestro has made the league's best defenders look like amateurs. They had no answer for his unpredictable style. Shaw, you'll never stop Donaldo by diving in recklessly. You need to focus on the ball, not the man. Yeah, not the ground either, dude. This isn't good, man. Don Aldo seriously damaged their confidence. That's an understatement. We've got one defender who's playing too aggressively, and another who isn't playing at all. Come on, Block. Just one tackle, a little one. Please? Please, Dougal, Dougal, Dougal. He says he's fine, as long as his teddy sharing him helps him practice. Those two need a break, a chance to get their heads back in the game. How are we going to do that and get them to Rio in time for the return leg? I think I have a way. <whistles> North, Block, I'm sending you on a confidence-building session in the Amazon before the game. A jungle adventure? At a luxury hotel. What? But it's the Amazon jungle, coach. It's meant to be about danger and excitement, not room service and little tiny shampoo bottles. The hotel has all the facilities and privacy you'll need to focus on stopping Donaldo. And who are we meant to play against? The bellboy? The world's greatest strike force. <gasps> Have I ever told you guys I was a junior wilderness cadet? I promise to use my cadet survival skills to keep us safe in the Amazon. Yeah, Klaus. Maybe you can get your ordering room service badge. Uh, I got that one ages ago. You gotta try to make the most of the situation, dude. 
Whatever. And here's my Junior Wilderness Cadet Navigation Badge, my Campfire Badge, my Air Guitar Badge, my <laughs> Mime Badge, my Listing Things Badge, my Crochet Badge, my Life of the Party Badge, my Pancake Eating Badge, my Growing Up Badge, my Not Understanding Social Cues Badge. Whoa, this is gonna be epic. Glad to see you're making the most of the situation. No point in complaining. Yep. Totally gonna make the most of the situation. Come on out! This jetty has been certified safe by a Junior Wilderness Cadet! Hold up, North! Coach said someone from the hotel was meeting us here. Come on! The place is just around the corner! Besides, we need to start practicing ASAP! Right? Yeah, uh, but... We got our gear, we got the players, all we need is the pitch. Okay, but only if you're sure you know where the hotel is. Don't worry, dude. I know exactly where we're going. Dancing Rasta. That was the hotel. North and the others didn't make their rendezvous. What? They're somewhere in the jungle. You're in charge till I get back. But coach, they're lost in the Amazon. That'll be like trying to find... There's some guys lost in the Amazon. Then I'd better get started. Um, what is that stuff? Oh, this? Volcanic ash and... Watermelon. Yeah, I fly some unusual jobs. You're hired. Name's Mara. Where are we headed? North, didn't you say the hotel was right around the corner? Chillax! It's a big corner! Yeah, what is that? I've got the Junior Wilderness Cadet Sound Identification Badge. It's a panther growl. No, 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 no. It's the wind. Hmm, perhaps thunder? I've got it! It's a waterfall! some lame hotel when we could go on an epic adventure. <gasps> you didn't. That's right. We're gonna find the lost stadium. That's insane. It's a made-up story. It doesn't exist. Um, Shakes? My junior wilderness cadet observation skills tell me that it might. to arrange the pickup somewhere down there. That'll be a fun landing. You sure about this? I've got a game to win. on the right path. We're supposed to be training for the Palma game, not going on some crazy treasure hunt. But that's the best part, dude. We can practice in the lost stadium. 
An actual pitch will be so much better than some hotel field. And it's not like we can go back to the way we came. You do know this is the worst plan ever, right? Chill! It's an adventure, dude. <sighs> well, come on, Mr. Ventura. Lead the way. Okay, you were right. The Lost Stadium is real. Now come on, let's go do some long overdue training. Ah! Ouch! Oh, hmm. So much better than some hotel field, eh, North? <sighs> yeah. all over the place. I can't follow it. Uh, oh, great. Stuck in the middle of nowhere and we can't train? Don't worry, guys. I'll use my junior wilderness cadet training to come up with a rescue plan. We'll be out of here in no time at all. We'll never get out of here. And it's all my fault. <sighs> because I'm a fake. I got all my Junior Wilderness Cadet badges on the internet. Wait, you didn't even have to go outside? Well, I had the window open. It's totally not your fault, Klaus. It's mine. Being dominated by Don Aldo, it, it totally messed me up. But instead of facing up to it, I, I dragged us into some crazy adventure. I put a tracker in Sheringham. I figured he'd be the one thing you wouldn't leave behind. So, did you at least manage to do some training? Pitch is covered with roots. It's too unpredictable. Unpredictable, eh? Get some rest, boys. We train at first light. of looking good if your friends aren't here to appreciate your awesomeness. I kind of even miss Shake Smelly Socks. <sighs> no. 
Listen up, guys. If Coach says he's gonna find our brothers, he'll do it. And we gotta do our part by giving Palma the toughest game of their lives. We play our hearts out for the first 45. Keep the score at nil-nil. We can do that, right? Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Then come on! Let's get out there and do it for our brothers! <laughs> yes. One, yes. Right two, on. three! <laughs> Super Strikers! Game on! I've never seen Super Strikers use such a defensive formation! Not surprising, considering half their team hasn't shown up. What is Coach thinking? No idea. He's missing too! Can the reserve defenders stop the Samba King? Huh? They don't have to! Dancing Rasta makes a brilliant tackle! It's all hands on deck for Super Strikers! Even their most attacking players are helping out in defense. <clears throat> but the question is, how long can they keep it up? <sighs> We're almost at half time. Don't let it slip now. And here comes Paul Mentieri again. This must be the final attack of the half. And for once, Donaldo makes it past Dancing Rasta. Can the reserve defenders stop the Samba King? <laughs> nope, his movements are just too unpredictable. No! Ecstasy for Paul Mentieri, but agony for Super Strikers. second half is about to start, and we have unconfirmed reports coming in that... Brenda! Could it be? But the way North Shaw and Block played last game, Coach might be better off sticking with the reserves. And the second half is underway. After last game, I thought you two would run off scared. I'm gonna make you wish you had. Now remember, watch the ball, not the man. Coach, we tried this and failed hard. The pitch is too unpredictable. Come on, dude. I know this isn't ideal, but... We've gotta make the most of our situation, right? Unpredictable pitch is the perfect way to prepare for an unpredictable player like Donaldo. But how's it gonna help us if we can't get back in time for the game? Don't worry about that. Our ride is almost here. But before we leave, I want to try one more drill. I've seen what the defenders have learned. Now it's the forward's turn. <laughs> Don Aldo can be stopped. 
Good doing business with you, Coach. Actually, I've got one more job for you. This is how to soak away those aches and pains. Yeah, I think I just earned my ultimate relaxation badge. <laughs> Guys, come look at this. Remember when North said Alberto Ventura never made it out of the jungle? Yeah? That's because he spent the rest of his life chilling in this hotel. <laughs> <laughs> it's just as well North isn't here to see this. I still don't get why he'd want to miss out on some mega relaxation. North hmm? hates this stuff, remember? So I gave him another chance to take on nature. <gasps> coach in Grimm's long history has stored their football knowledge in an ancient, powerful book. The Tactinomicon! <gasps> Could someone please close that window? Sorry! Uh, Whatever. So over the top. The ghost train does sound kinda... Don't say it, dude! Scary. Huh? Why? Really? Uh, aren't we gonna need a goalie to stop the ghost train? Yeah, why does Big Bo get time off before the game? Big Bo is doing top secret preparation for the ghost train. He's our last line of defense against them. Does playing Super Strikers have a personal significance for Grim FC? Big Bo did accidentally injure your legendary striker, Spike Dawson. Not at all. Spike Dawson was a great player, but his spitefulness tainted the good name of this club. I'm glad to say we've seen the last of him. Ha! <laughs> That's what you think. My beautiful trophies. But my collection is incomplete. Not for long, though. Soon I will end Big Bo's career just like he ended mine and claim his gloves as my final trophy! Spike! I baked you some strudel! Mother! Don't interrupt me while I'm plotting revenge! Don't you backchat me, young man! Sorry, Mom. Planning to leave the goalie cave anytime soon, sir? It's getting musty in here. All worth it, Albert. I'm beginning to understand how Grimm's new move works. They stay in a very tight formation to hide the position of the ball. The keeper doesn't know where the shot is coming from. My positioning and reflexes will have to be spot on to stand any chance against the ghost train. And how do you plan to achieve that, sir? The quad cannons. I told Grim FC they'd be nothing without me! Especially after I steal their precious Tactonomicon! 
now to pay Big Bo a visit. <laughs> Mom, I'm stuck. Don't worry, dearie. I'll get this fruit of grapes. We'll get you out of there in no time. Activate quad cannons. Quad cannons activated. Yes, yes, I heard you the first 30 times. Would you like to buy some strudel, dearie? Hmm, delicious. Come inside. I can't resist a good strudel. Why, thank you. Dearie. an authorized quad cannon technician. Ah, my beautiful trophy. <laughs> this revenge thing is getting really old, Spike. I won't stop until End I... End my career just like I ended yours. Like I said, old. But I'm not injured. Your plan failed. Ha! Ah, that's what you think! But you're not the only one who knows all the angles, Big Bo. Huh? Huh. Uh, excuse me, sir. Could you help me, please? I'm terribly sorry, sir. That old woman lured me in with lies and delicious strudel. That wasn't an old woman. It was Spike Dawson. Spike Dawson? After all this time, what are we going to do about him? Nothing for now. I need to rest up for the game against Grimm. Are you done playing with your friend, Spike? Sworn enemy, Mother! Big Bo is my sworn enemy! And the game I'm playing is only just beginning. <laughs> Super League Disciplinary Board. I have information regarding the theft of the Tectonomicon. Morning, sir. Sleep well? Yep. I'm ready to bring the ghost train screeching to a halt. Don't buy any strudel, okay? Very funny, sir. I'm Agent 1. I'm Agent 2. From the Super League Disciplinary Board. I don't have a number yet, but if I help crack the case, I can totally earn one! Read your agent rulebook, rookie. Rule 4.73. A Super League agent always remains calm. It keeps your mind clear and makes you look extra cool at all times. Uh, how exactly can I help you, gentlemen? We got a tip-off that Big Bo was involved in the theft of the Tactonomicon. You're not the only one who knows all the angles, Big Bo! Spike wasn't trying to injure me. He was trying to frame me. Mind if we take a look around? Um, what 
makes you think Big Bo was involved in this crime? We got an anonymous tip. Besides, with Big Bo facing the ghost train, no one would have more to gain from stealing the book. I found it! I found it! I found it! I found it! Protocol, Junior. Rule 1.7. A Super League agent never smiles. There's some kind of grease on here. Same stuff we found on Grimm's bus. Big Bo is now our prime suspect. <laughs> I want Strike a Land secured immediately. Spike must have planted the Tactonomicon here last night. He's trying to get me banned for life. So, what are we going to do about it? Clearing my name would be good, but duty calls. The game, sir? At the risk of stating the obvious, there's nowhere to hide on a football pitch. Hmm. Maybe I don't have to. Here we go. The Super League Agent's Rulebook. I have a plan that'll let me play the game, stop the ghost train, and prove Spike framed me. Sounds easy enough, sir. Match night at Strikerland. And the terrifying Grim fans descend on the stadium. But they're nothing compared to the team itself. <laughs> but by far the weirdest thing tonight is Super Strikers are starting with their number two goalie, Noah Murdoch. If any goalie can stop the ghost train, surely it's Big Bo. <laughs> Hear that, Brenda? Chugga, 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 chugga. Do, do. Here comes the ghost train. Where's the ball? No idea, dude! Throw the ball! Super Strikers are gonna need a bigger goalie. Hold it. We're looking for someone matching your description. Never mind. Move along, kids. I'm so sorry, guys. I let you down. Don't worry, dude. No one's been able to stop the ghost train. So far. <gasps> Big Bo? Where have you been, man? Well, Spike framed me for stealing the Tactonomicon, and now I'm kind of on the run from the SLDB. Huh? I hate to be Captain Insensitive, but did you find a way to stop the ghost train, Big Bo? Don't worry, guys. I know all the angles. Wait a second. If you can stop the ghost train, it'll totally seem like you stole the Tactonomicon. It is gonna look weird, man. Have you thought about, you know, missing the save on purpose? Yeah, some things are more important than football. Mm. Or not. I won't let Spike Dawson win. I'm gonna go out there, and I'm gonna stop the ghost train. How are you even gonna get on the pitch? This place is crawling with Super League agents. With a bit of luck and a bit of help from the Super League rulebook. The good news for Super Strikers fans is that the hapless Noah Murdoch has been taken off. And the uh, bad news, Mac, is that they haven't replaced him. Super Strikers are starting the second half without a goalkeeper. Big Bo, stop right there. Rule 54.72, know the suspect. You put your whole career at risk just to learn how to stop the ghost train. There's no way you'd miss this game. You, you guys got it all wrong. I didn't steal the Tactonomicon. I was framed by Spike Dawson. Give yourself up, Big Bo. You've got nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. I don't need to hide. Rule 7.94. Ah, don't tell me. I know this one. <laughs> no Super League agents are allowed on the field during game time.
Big Bo slipped through our fingers. I want him apprehended the moment the final whistle blows. Affirmative. 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 With Big Bo back on the pitch, do Super Strikers have a chance against Grimm? We're about to find out, Brenda. Affirmative. All right, guys. Big Bo risked everything for this team. Let's make it worth his while. Affirmative. It's a goal. This is an outrage. Big Bo's a cheat. The name Spike Dawson ring any bells. Big Bo claimed he set him up. Bah! Ridiculous. Spike Dawson's ancient history. Hello? Anybody home? What's that? You're on the run from the law? Oh, I'll just let myself in then. Oh, I've waited so long for this moment. With Big Bo out the way, I can finally collect my trophy. What? No, no! This can't be! Grim FC on the attack oh. again. But this time, the mighty Big Bo stands between them and the goal. Huh? He's playing? Those gloves will be mine! <laughs> so far, so good. It's all up to you now, sir. Big Bo helped his team level the scores! But his real challenge is about to begin! Uh, the Ghost Train! Can't believe I'm saying this, but kind of hope Big Bo misses. I know what you mean, man. Son. Affirmative. Strudel? <laughs> huh? Crunchy delicious Strudel? Strudel? Get your hot Strudel! <gasps> gotcha. <laughs> huh? We're well into injury time. Will Big Bo prevail? Or will the ghost train ride him down? I have to lure Spike out into the open, or I'm done for. But how? Ah, my beautiful trophy. My positioning and reflexes will have to be spot on. Big Bo's taking the gloves off, literally. He's really bought into the whole showmanship thing. Big Bo will pay for his disrespect. Grim have broken through. Only Big Bo stands between Grim FC and victory. over Big Bo's gloves. Hey, isn't that Spike Dawson? Gotcha. What? Big Bo was telling the truth. All agents move in. Get Spike Dawson. You did it! Oh, thanks, guys. 
The soccer mystery of the century and all the strudel you can eat and I missed them both. Luckily, Big Bo catches everything. Yeah, man. You really weren't kidding when you said you had all the angles covered. How did he fit in there? Strudel grease. Ew. Hey, isn't that the same stuff they found on Grimm's bus and on the Tectonomicon? Great work, Junior. You've earned these. <laughs> Protocol, Greenhorn. A Super League agent never smiles. But we'll allow it this one time, Agent 3. 127. <laughs> I told you about playing in the garbage. Uh, sorry, Mother. Well, come on, then. Let's go home. We're in the final few minutes at Strikerland, and the score is still tied. But Liquido makes another break for goal. And he's fast as ever, 18 miles an hour. But if there's one man who can keep up with him, it's Twisting Tiger. 19 miles an hour. 20 miles an hour for Laquido. Oh, 21 for Tiger. From Laquido. But the ref says play on. Looks like you need a new lucky charm, bro. With Twisting Tiger on the ground, no one can catch Laquido. Goal! Oh, one nil to the visitors. And there's Laquido's signature shirt up celebration. Can you believe that guy? Yeah, Laquido totally fouled you, Tiger. Just wait till next game. You're gonna own him. Oh, please. If you think you're gonna get lucky at the floating stadium, you're wrong. I'm always faster at home. Voila! Hmm. Too much fat, too much sauce, and too much food. I need the guys lean and mean for the return leg. Pfft. I am Jacques Cousteau, creator of culinary intrigue. I am not here to help people diet. Sorry, Jacques. Extreme circumstances call for extreme preparation. Isn't that right, boys? <laughs> Whoa, this is awesome, coach. Uh, what are we doing in here? Rough? No! Oh, nah. Well, it's quite possible Hydro are the fastest team in the Super League because of their ingress to the greatest natural resistance training apparatus in the known universe. Um, uh, can you translate that for the average human? <laughs> and also for El Matador, please. Hydro train underwater. Exactly, Block. Water is a thousand times denser than air. Training in it will make playing on land seem like, well, actually running on air. Okay, let's see if underwater training has made you any faster on land. Fastest first. Yeah, look out, Liquido. Tiger, you hit 24 miles per hour last game. Let's see if you can beat that. Gotcha, coach. 20. Sticks! Unbelievable. Dude. Oh, man. And. The longer you train in water, the faster you'll be. We leave for the floating stadium in three days. Uh, back in the tank? Back in the tank. Seven years at ship school. Nine years at Bistro Bersanto. Six Michelin stars for this. What is this? It's what I call rice limage. Rice on a bit of more rice, 
in the shape of your face. Come on, coach. We've trained underwater the whole week. Can't we have some real food? Your training will count for nothing if you aren't lean and mean, boys. Yeah, coach. We're lean and you're mean. How about a deal? If we beat Hydra, we get to have an awesome feast right here on the way home. So, what do you say, coach? <sighs> sure. Yeah! <laughs> Ready to lose again? Don't be so sure, dude. Yeah, been doing some underwater training of our own. What? Did you practice in the bathtub? We train in the ocean, right up until the game. That's why we're always faster at home. Tiger hit 28 miles an hour. Yeah, that's right. He'd beat you for pace anytime, any place. Oh, yeah? How about right now? on the bottom of the ocean. What? I don't know about this, guys. Next level underwater training? A chance to show Liquido up? Come, Come on, on, dude! dude. <sighs> Fine. Compact breathing apparatus? Air lasts for ages. Comms device, built into your mask. Good for dissing. <laughs> Weight belt, stops you from floating back up to the surface. Helpful. A choice. Been thrown in the deep end. You see anything? Too far down. Man, worst FOMO ever. Ready to be school. <laughs> faster. What do you think of that, Liquido? Huh? Liquido? <laughs> huh? See a match day, bro. No! Wait, Liquido! How do I get this belt off? With my lucky charm. Mwah! <laughs> Tiger? <gasps> yeah! You weigh a ton, <sighs> dude! How do you get this thing off? You can't! Liquido set me up. There's only one key, and he has it. Ugh, that sea snake! Yeah, what was I thinking? We gotta tell Coach. No, 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 no. Don't need to bother him, dude. We'll totally find the key. Hmm, I don't know. Come on, we got this. <sighs> Fine. Kurumulu. You've heard of the Super League, right? Now, low in fat, low in amoeba acids, and low in taste as well, I give you Super Legumes. Uh, beans? Yeah, beans. 
All worth it when we beat Hydra, boys. Any luck? <sighs> no sign of the key. Or Laquito. Tiger? Uh, Jock! So, how's the celebration menu coming along? It will be one of the finest meals I have ever made. And definitely the finest meal any of you have eaten. Really? Like, what are you thinking? Uh, how about hot dogs, Jacques? <laughs> of course! Oh, yeah, yeah, you bet I'm good dog. to me. I would rather make the diet food. Stupid faulty chair. Uh, what a weak chair, right? I know what's going on here. Tiger. You haven't been sticking to the diet, have you? Uh... Busted, Tiger! <laughs> Get back on track, Tiger. We need you in top form tomorrow. <sighs> Too close. You guys said you'd get me out of this thing. Now do it! Telling coach. <sighs> aye, aye, aye. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, oh no! This is bad. Uh, you must really feel like you have the weight of the world on your shoulders. It isn't the weight of the world. It's Hydra's weight. Weren't you listening? Oh, sorry, guys. I've let everyone down. I was ready for this game, and now I'm useless. <sighs> Coach, we'll do whatever it takes to sort this out. Correct. You two are getting the toughest job on the pitch. Twisting Tiger's job. You're marking Liquido. Tiger, just because you're on the bench doesn't mean we don't need you 100% focused on this game. Sure, Coach. First health food, now. <clears throat> At dogs. I feel so ashamed. Hey, Mr. Chef, you open for business? <laughs> I am Jacques Cousteau. I serve kings, not peasants. Aw, oh, come on, dude. Game's about to start, and I gotta get my munch on. Yeah, we'll eat whatever. Prepare yourselves for the gourmet feast of a lifetime. Match day at the Floating Stadium. Oh boy, here we go, Brenda. Tiger versus Laquido, the battle of the speedsters. Uh, I don't think so, Mac. Uh, what is Coach thinking? He's put his fastest player on the bench. But, but, why? And we're off. Can Super Strikers contain Liquido without twisting Tiger? Shakes immediately marks Liquido. But you don't need a speed tracker to know he's just not fast enough. Too soon, Brenda. Too soon. Now <laughs> North is on Liquido. Coach isn't giving Hydra an inch. Laquito's through on goal! But great last-ditch tackle from North Shaw. <laughs> this is a good start from Super Strikers. Shakes and North are making life tough for Laquido. I don't know if I can keep this up for 90 minutes. 
Maybe we don't have to. Follow my lead. Prepare to have your taste buds enlightened. Uh, you don't do hot dogs? You said you did anything I served. Yeah, but it's a soccer match, bud. You gotta make hot dogs. The hot dogs are for super strikers. If I give them to you, what will they eat? <laughs> Two hot dogs coming right up. We are well into the final third, and still no sign of Twisting Tiger. <laughs> Wow, Laquito, you are fast. Huh. Don't you know it? Pity you don't have a chance to prove you're the fastest. Huh? Well, Tiger did beat you on your underwater pitch. Uh, hello? I threw the underwater game? Sure you did, buddy. In a real race, I take Twisting Tiger any day. Oh, yeah? Prove it. <laughs> right. You want me to give you the key. Nice try. But this game ain't for pride. It's for points. Oh. Finally, Super Striker's two-on-one strategy has caved in. And here comes Liquido's shirt-up celebration. Uh, or not. Coach, Liquido signature celebration. He didn't do it. So? Really? Put me on and I'll find out. Can you even get close to Liquido with that belt on? One chance is all I need. <laughs> Hundreds of hot dogs ready to roll. Woohoo! delicious. Two for me, please. <laughs> Thanks, man. Gotta scram. Something big's happening. Good riddance to bad nourishment. Tell your friends, okay? Super Striker's substitution. Ah, finally! But it hasn't worked. <laughs> Guess we have final proof your charm isn't lucky, bro. You should worry about your own lucky charm. <gasps> what? Huh? Was Tiger wearing a weight belt? But that means... You think underwater training makes you fast? It's nothing compared to weight belt training. Liquido shoots! Big Bo is beat! What? Looks like the tide may have turned. Dude, I thought you'd take Twisting Tiger any day. Ah. 29 miles an hour for Tiger! But Lucrino is still on him, Mac. <laughs> no! The Super Striker's winger has gone supersonic! 30 miles an hour! Blink and you missed it! 
Hey, Laquito. See, my lucky charm always delivers. Hey, uh, do you think if I kissed that thing, I'd get more lucky? <laughs> well done, Tiger. That was some plan. Now, unless I'm mistaken, it's time to chow down on some epic hot dogs! Woohoo! Diggity <laughs> yeah. yeah. Get your hot dogs here! The finest hot dogs ever created! Hey, isn't that our celebration meal? <laughs> now that's fast food. Jacques, what is going on here? I'm just giving the people what they want. And they wanted hot dogs! What are we going to eat? Finally, a five-star gourmet fist pit for Super League Kings. Bon appétit, Super Strikers. Uh, what is that? Uh. <laughs> Being the most refined of all of you, I love this gourmet food. Snails and fish eggs. Oh, coach. Where are Tiger Shakes and North? Do you really think I'd let them join the feast after the stunt they pulled? Oh, shame. Poor guys. All right, Tiger! <laughs> uh, but how? They ran out so fast. Not as fast as me. <laughs> Two nil to Super Strikers, and Big Bo's had nothing to do all game. Oh! Ah! Ah! Nakama are in Super Strikers' box. Ooh! Ah, nothing to get excited about, Brenda. Block is there. But if he doesn't get this tackle right, it's a penalty for sure. for the big man. Blocks the cleanest tackler in the Super League. You rock, Block! A third Right on right. man. Listen up, guys. The Robotics in Football exhibition is coming up next week. Prof? Oh, uh, well, we thought we'd do something special this year, so I've made a robot. Of one of you. Huh? Hmm? Uh, hmm. Must be cool joke. He does the best robot. <laughs> it must be me. Why replicate anyone less good looking than the great El Matador? Huh? Huh? Ooh. Ooh. Introducing Roblox. Tony, why does this tin can get to travel with the team? Cause, unlike you lot, Chip T. Chuckerson is going to win me a prize. The game? Against Super Strikers? Oh. The other difference between Chip and you lot is he can actually learn things. Copy movie star. I need your clothes, your boots, and your shin guards. Um, I don't understand, Tony. He's gonna win me the robotics and football exhibit. Iron Tank are already the perfect robots. Ow! No foul, player. No foul. And the Robotics in Football, football grand, grand Prize goes, goes to... to... Yes? Yes? Roblox! Yeah. What? Block. Huh? A quick interview, perhaps? I can translate if you want. Been learning Brazilian. Tell me about your robot twin. <laughs> Physically, Roblox is a perfect copy of me. How could they give the award to the robotic dimwit? He's just a mindless replica. So, 
How's this football? The rubber is locked. I don't know. <laughs> Prof says playing against Roblox would be extremely dangerous because he's all steel and hydraulics. Oh, really? So what will he be doing at Strikerland? Welcome to Strikerland, home of the Super League's greatest team. Ah, a tour guide. So, who do you predict will win this weekend? Super Strikers or Technicali? I predict Super Strikers will prevail in our next game. Nice. Block? Circle block, take the blazer. Um, I'm only halfway through the Brislovian course, uh, but if you ask me, Lena, I just need to score one goal, and Block will take care of the rest. Not if I take care of Block first. Copy, Block. Broker, sir. <laughs> <laughs> now, if I could just figure out how to get your processor into that lumbering pile of nuts and bolts. Stop! First law of robotics, no water. Water will make you malfunction. But you have given me an idea. Technology from previous inventions. For example, I used the analytical algorithm from the magic of Roblox eyes. Water! Get Roblox out of here! Go! Go, Chip! Go! exhibit has been locked down with all robots inside. No, no, no! There was so much he still had to see to do. Sure, that was one awesome robot block, Prof. In hindsight, it would have been difficult to make a robot as good looking as me. This sucks. Schmeigelfleur. Clear all robot parts. Send those tin cans to the scrapyard. Yes, it worked. And by the time Super Strikers realize they're playing with a robot, half the team will be injured. <laughs> Let's put the robotics exhibit behind us, okay? I don't want it affecting our performance against Technicali. Now, get to it. El Matador? Uh... My preparation will be purely mental, Coach. Reminding myself how awesomely amazing I am. <sighs> hey, Block. I reckon the best practice I can get is against the world's best defender. You. you seem different. I think I'll do some training where I won't end up in hospital. Oh! These super strikers are too fast and skilled to be injured by Roblox. Hmm? But my players aren't. John J. Johnson Jr. Hi, Tony! I've come up with a strategy for you. Great. Let's hear it. Dribbling. Ah, uh, again? I thought the doctor cleared that up. He means dribbling a soccer ball. I want you to dribble straight at block, John J. Johnson, Jr. Isn't that kind of risky? With Roblox on the pitch, there'll be cards for Super Strikers and penalty kicks for Technicali. <sighs> I am Roblox, the robot block. The true legend is over there. Huh? Danger! 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 Welcome to Strikerland, home of the Super League Trophy. 
Let's begin our tour. Urkel. Okay, boys. Let's call it for today. Be the block. What's up with you? You seem different. Hey, Block. You coming? Surely, lad. Something's up with Block. He's playing weird, speaking weird. Shaw shakes, dude. It's not like you're an authority on Breslovian. Yeah, brother. Aren't you still learning? <laughs> Cassette tape? Yeah. Latest technology in Breslovia. <laughs> <laughs> Gerbil Zerk Glarg Bzork. Yep, I know that one. Next up, Zerk Lagerb Blurgle Strazer. Blurgle Strazer. Hey. <sighs> okay, tape six. Huh? Weird. Where are six to nine? Are you ready for the final level of Learn Brislovian? Here we go. Rarl clad Zuzangle crad blook Jaraz Burko. Got it. Huh. If my Brazilian isn't dodgy, then what's up with block? Next up, Zorglang the Zerkle Bar. Oh, tapes! Block the Rock! Block! One of our main values at Strike a Land is determination. It's much day in a fight club. No matter where you are, whatever you're doing, it's a fantastic day for a bit of football. Super strikers have been looking good, but Chuck T. Chipperson is in great form. Block will need to be on top of his game, Mac. I'm sure he will be uh, He's so reliable, always there when super strikers need him. Block, we need to talk. Purple. Zergle Purple Gerb? The Razor Grinlock, crew colonel for Boomba. He says he's been under a lot of pressure lately. Wow, Chicks, your Brislovian has really improved. Yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> Block, I know something's wrong. Your game, your Brislovian, it's like you're a different person. Kirkserblogger, grab the goal. Excuse me? Kirkserblogger, grab the goal. Huh? You took my tapes. But why would you need to learn Brislovian? <laughs> because you're not Block. You're Roblox. You can't go out there. You, you can't play. You'll hurt people. Roblox, listen to me! Please remember to look after your belongings during the tour. And last out, last week's man of the match, Block! Oh, no! He's a machine, Brenda. Well, where's she? I? Thought we had a first choice 11 on both sides. Klaus, warm up. Eagle Eye, Grizz, get shakes. Oh, uh, what's the strategy again? Uh, you run straight at block. Oh, right. striker to do business with Block. Wow. So unlike Block. Yes! <laughs> I mean, what was that? Whatever happened to fair play? Keep it tidy, Block. Another one, and the card's coming out. Shakes! 
Jakes! I don't get it. Where did he go? Restroom? It's down the stairs, first left, second right, immediate right, and straight ahead. Next up, the Strike of Lance Ball. Isn't it total luxury? Well, folks, all good things must come to an end. for the final part of our exciting tour. And it gets worse, the big defender. Penalty huh? to technicality. Lock best clean up his act soon, or he'll be sent off. Fasten your seatbelts, because the final stop on our tour is the strike land Garage. to a surprisingly poor performance from Block. Who would have thought? First a missing striker, now a defender whose brain's gone missing? North. Uh, uh, Shakes? Don't let anyone know I've been here. That's not Block, it's Roblox. Yeah, and I always take advice from dudes hiding in lockers. He put me in here. He finds out you're onto him and you're next. You need to get him out of here. Block, what is wrong with you? Pixel Blogger, grab the goo. Oh, I know this one. Block's uh, hitting the showers. Right, Block? Since when do you speak Breslovian? I've been taking night classes. That isn't Block. It's Roblox. Hmm. Yeah, right. The dangerous tackling, weird Brislovian, cold, steely demeanor? Well, we're about to find out if I'm right. Why is that, Shakes? Robots don't take showers. <laughs> So if that's Roblox, where's Blow? <laughs> Super Strikers drive only the coolest vehicles. Well, there's our tour guide. Someone switched the robot's processors. Shakes, you were right, dude. But where is Block? <laughs> He says we've got to go on for the second half, or we'll forfeit the game. Muggle Blah. Don't worry, he's got this. Can't wait for him any longer. Huh? huh?
they didn't sub him? Looks like your work isn't done, John J. Johnson, Jr. Uh, block! You did it! Uh, I think? The second half is about to start, and Super Strikers have a lot of work to do. Well, Coach should have started by subbing Block. He's the reason they're losing. Finish John J. Johnson Jr. once and for all! And get what he deserves a red card! <laughs> That's more like it! Vintage block! Smooth, slick, and effective! Oh, I'm too clever! My invention has learned to play like the best defender in the league! <laughs> Sorry, Tony, you're wrong. No one can play like the block. Have a block, Zerbo! No! 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 Whatever was troubling Block in the first half is ancient history. Nice one, brother! <laughs> Block, you did it! And where is your very scary thrill? A third of Herbom! So I'm hanging from Strike the Land, Roblox about to ditch me, when suddenly I remember something. My new robot friend. And now for the final part of our tour. Ta-da! Uh, uh, I need to close the smile flare. Copy. Probable. Eh, I think Prof should just make a robot that looks like me next time. But how do we know we aren't all robots already? Oh! Hi, guys. Welcome to another Orion fan report, live from the Soccer Sphere. <laughs> we have some pretty tough games coming up. First, Invincible United, then Super Strikers. But as always, in Coach Black we trust. Oh. What? What is that? been an alien fighting at a soccer stadium. A close encounter of the first kind. But is it legitimate? Impossible to tell. We need a man on the ground. Anyone know anything about football? Uh, that's the one with the ball, right? I've already identified the perfect candidate. He knows soccer. He has access to the stadium. And most importantly, he's a believer. Klaus, prepare to make contact. We've just witnessed the upset of the season, boys. Orion anticipated Invincible United's every move, predicted their every strategy, and dominated the scoreline. I know how they did it. Coach Black has been getting help from aliens. This again? Uh, Klaus. I've watched this clip like 20 times. I'm telling you guys, it's real. There's no such thing as aliens. Those videos are just CGI. <laughs> Klaus has been spending way too much time on the bench, coach. If it isn't aliens, how did Orion know Invincible United's entire game plan? Coach Black obviously studied their previous games and learned their strategies. But what if he's done the same to us, Coach? Don't worry. I've developed two all-new, never-before-seen moves. It's of the utmost importance 
that we keep them top secret. That means no talking about them. I don't even want you to think about them. Because the aliens can read our brainwaves, right? Focus on these moves, not UFO sightings. Got it? Got it, Coach. You'd think it was match day at the Soccer Sphere, but actually, Orion Stadium is now the world's newest alien sightings hotspot. Take me home, E.T. They live amongst us, man. The lights! They're coming for us! I'm now joined by Orion manager Coach Black, live from his observatory on top of the Soccer Sphere. Coach Black, what do you make of these so-called UFO sightings? <laughs> the lights are merely a beautiful cosmic ray shower. Huh. I bet his alien overlords told him to say that. Turn that thing off already. El Matador must go betty by. Your side destroyed Invincible United last week. Some people claim you were helped by, you know, these, these... Aliens? <laughs> that is priceless. <laughs> but seriously, my secret is just, uh, thorough preparation. Well, it seems like the sky is the limit for Orion. As for the UFOs, I'll leave that to the experts. The truth is totally out there, man. The lights! They're still coming for us! Why wouldn't they come to Earth? Huh? Who are you? We're a top secret organization of specialists. We search for and monitor alien activity on Earth. We're the first, second, middle, second last, and only line of defense. We are the National Extraterrestrial Reconnaissance Division. Oh. Ow. Ah. He always does this. The intention was for this to remain a clandestine operation, you dope. Sorry, guys. If it makes you feel any better, you put on a great show. Now, what do you guys want? We know you've been watching the lights of Orion footage. Of course. It's the most conclusive proof we are not alone. We're looking for someone who can find out the truth about the lights. Someone with access to the soccer sphere? We're looking for someone like you, Klaus. What? Me? An alien hunter? Ah, oh, I can't. What? what? Why not? We've got a big game coming up. I need to concentrate on our new... <gasps> not meant to talk about them. <gasps> not even meant to think about them. Sorry, I'm not your guy. <gasps> I knew it! Top circles! I told you guys there were aliens here. Oh, please! There is a perfectly rational explanation for this. Yep. I made them. Huh? No wonder you wanted me to keep quiet about the aliens. You're one of them. There's no way I was going to teach you the top secret. You know what? Then practice them at Orion's home stadium the day before the game. So I created the most private training facility in town. This is the last time you're going to see these moves. So pay attention. No peeking, defenders. Hmm? We're going to test these moves on you guys. Move one uses the overlap to find space behind the defense. Ain't getting past us, bro. I know, but El Matador will. Move two uses pace and passing to break through the opposition defense. <laughs> nice work, boys. You get all that? I may need you out there tomorrow. Yes, coach. There's no way Orion will see these moves coming.
Klaus, haven't you watched that video enough? Beauty sleep required. Where is your rational explanation for this, El Matador? It's just, uh, Orion testing their floodlights. Floodlights coming from the sky? Well, it still makes more sense than aliens. If you're so sure about it, let's go find out. Reports are streaming in. It's happening again. That's not all. Klaus is on the move, heading right for the stadium. Ha! I knew he couldn't resist the search for the truth. Wait, we're tracking Klaus? <gasps> you guys never tell me anything. Yeah, that's because you tell your mom all our secret information. No, I don't. Hmm. Klaus seems to have activated the camera on his Digitab. I should be able to access the feed. Whoa! <laughs> mom! You gotta see this! Oh, Super League legends sneaking around like grave robbers. I can't believe I let you talk me into this. Klaus? Huh? Am I dreaming? Only if you are dreaming about how right I was. Hey, is it just me, or are these lights following a pattern? There was a pattern, yeah? Definitely a sign of intelligent life. take on the mighty Super Strikers. Here at the Soccer Sphere, it's come one, come all for alien enthusiasts. Although someone needs to tell them they're here to watch the football, not the skies. One man who will definitely be keeping his eyes on the game is Orion's coach, Black, still in his observatory. Yes, Lina. From up here, I have a perfect view of the galaxy and what's happening on the beach. Hmm. The lights, <laughs> they're coming. <laughs> they take your brain waves. Wow, I didn't know crazy was contagious. What's gotten into you, El Matador? What, there's something inside me? Ah, oh, they laid their alien eggs inside of me. Oh, get them out, get them out. Tell me, Klaus, where do you think El Matador got all these crazy ideas? You got to listen to me. The lights, they were... Say lights one more time. I dare you. As for you, I don't care if an alien invited you to a tea party. You're in the starting lineup. Super Strikers may be in good form, but they've never played against a team receiving help from out there. Oh, Mac, not you too. <laughs> I'm just getting into the spirit of things, Brenda. Super Strikers attack and attack. But Orion are way ahead of them. Almost as if they're getting help from... Don't you say it, Mac. Move one. 
daring pass from Dancing Rasta. They obviously practiced that one in training. That Twisting Tiger's run straight into a dead end. Oh, no, he hasn't. Ha -ha! Brilliant deception from Super Strikers. Wow, oh, heads up. <laughs> no way. Once again, Orion are just too good. How did Maiden know? Last chance of the first half. Come on, dude. It's up to us. Okay, let's do it, Shakes. Huh? Ah! <laughs> <gasps> They're here. Aliens! <laughs> El Matador certainly keen to get back to the locker room. Maybe he needs the toilet. You. That was a close one. What? Coach! You can sub me, drop me from the team, make me wash everyone's dirty socks, but you have to listen to me about the lights. Ugh. Fine. You have my attention. The lights I saw last night were tracing out the exact patterns of our secret moves. Even if I did believe you, how can you prove this? I recorded it all on my Digitab last night. But I dropped it. Face it, Klaus. You don't have proof because there's no such thing as aliens. <sighs> the truth is in here. What is this? National Extraterrestrial Reconnaissance Division at your service. And we are dead. Nerd? Really? What are you guys doing here? We've been trying to contact you, man. Uh, last night in the cornfield? That was you? You scared the pants off me. Why did you dress like that? Uh, why wouldn't we dress like this? There's something you all need to see. Klaus, we accessed the video you recorded on your Digitab last night. Well, I never. Klaus is right. Those lights are following the exact patterns of our moves. And check this out. Beta? Wait! So that's how Orion knew our first secret move. But where are the lights coming from? Please don't say aliens. The truth is actually up there. You can try any secret move you want, but you won't stand a chance against Orion. Because I have reached new heights of football excellence! <laughs> In space, no one can hear you laugh. So where's Coach Black? <coughs> Observe. He was up in space the whole time. After surveilling your moves from his space station, he traced them out with the lights, teaching his players how to counter them. And the UFO hysteria was the perfect cover-up. I knew there was something weird about those interviews. <laughs> <sighs> Klaus, you have great intuition, both on and off the pitch. I should have trusted you more. Uh, sorry to ruin the moment, but how's knowing this gonna help us in the second half? Yeah, we only have one move left, and you know the cat's out of the bag on that one. Well, Coach Black doesn't know that we are onto him. What are you thinking, Klaus? I have an idea for another new move. 
With the score still deadlocked, Coach is making his first substitution. Strange decision. Klaus hasn't been on the first team for ages. Ah, hello, Mr. Snooper Striker. You were terrified of the lights last night, but you're about to find out how scary they really are. <laughs> Move to brothers. Come on. <laughs> Just as expected. <laughs> I hope you're watching. Shakes to Twisting Tiger. Back to Shakes. Another failure. Orion saw the danger a mile away. Nowhere to go, Shakes. <laughs> huh? But Orion have left Klaus open in the middle. That's not move two. Follow Klaus. Follow Klaus. Follow Klaus! Believer Brenda. No comment. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Wait, that means Super Strike is one, right? No idea. Yes! The one! Yeah! <laughs> I gotta call my mom! Yeah! 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 Yes! <laughs> They do it! I hate them! I hate them! I... Self-destruct oh. mechanism activated. No! Yes, you have 20 seconds to enter the escape pod. Stupid ship! You have 10 seconds to enter the escape pod. Ready came true. We won. 